Sometimes when you try to install an application, such as the Firefox or any of these other files in here, you will get an error message saying to help protect your PC, we suggest that you get a Microsoft verified app. For example, if I try to launch this, even as an administrator, after a few seconds, it will give an error message saying to help protect your PC, we suggest you get a Microsoft verified app. The reason you might come across this error on Windows 10 and Windows 11 machines is because a security setting in your configuration has changed. It is very easy to fix this. What you need to do is to go to the start, go to the settings of your Windows 11, go under applications or apps, under apps and features. At the very top, there is an option called choose where to get apps and change this option from the Microsoft Store only recommended to anywhere. And now, if you go back and try to launch this application as an administrator, it will give you the UAC and you can say yes and you can proceed with your installation process. Please keep in mind that this change may not be possible if you are on a domain and your domain administrator has locked the options under settings uh, and app section. So this is only possible if you are the administrator or local administrator uh, for this particular machine or the administrator for the domain itself. So keep that in mind. So if you are working on an office computer, you may not be able to change these options on your Windows 11 machine. On Windows 10 machines, you can find the same option under Start, Settings, under App section. At the very top, we can change this, choose where to get the apps from the Microsoft Store only recommended to anywhere. By default, typically when you install Microsoft Windows, whether it's Windows 11 or Windows 10, it will be set to anywhere, but however it is possible, that your administrator may have changed or one of the settings have changed under the apps uh, section where somebody changed this to the recommended settings. So that's how you bypass that error and get to install your applications. Until next time, thank you so much and have a nice day.